What up people, it's your boy Chig from Gluna Eagle Eye coming to you again with a brand new video. This time is to talk about a certain supposed bid that Arsenal have made for Thomas Lamar. You heard me a couple of days ago describe this kid as special. For me, this this type of exciting would be just as it would be just as exciting as us potentially signing a Mbappe. Um in a lot of ways, it'd be more exciting than us uh, signing Lacazette, if I'm being real. I'm really, really chuffed that it looks like Arsenal are going for this guy. But let me not get too excited. The Southampton of the French division, known as Monaco, have basically said, nah, we ain't selling him. Nah, you, you ain't taking all of our players. What's going on? Because they are literally getting stripped for their players right now. Getting stripped for their players. My only criticism is this. For me, um, so they've rejected the bid, if I hadn't made that clear. The bid was in the region of... Uh, some papers don't seem to know what's happening. One paper reckons we bid £26 million. Another paper thinks we bid £30.4 million. Pounds. Um, either way, they're both rejected. Um, my worry with, with this particular bid is this. We watched City come in and take one of their best players in Bernardo Silva. Um, and I feel like if we were more decisive and had gone for this player, at, um, even maybe before City did, we may be in advanced talks with him. We might have closed it out. At some point, Monaco are obviously going to do a Southampton. The way Southampton are doing with Van Dijk, they're, of course they're going to try and stop the rot. And I feel like... It, it's just indicative of our style. If we had moved quickly for this kid, who knows? We might be genuinely gonna we might be genuinely tying this deal up. But now we're having to play this waiting game because I can't see Arsenal upping their bid much further past 30 million. Even though papers all day have been talking about how um Wenger's gonna do everything it fuck it takes to get this kid. I'm skeptical. Um, I don't really, I don't really, I, I, I don't know. I, I'm going to try and be hopeful. I'm going to be try and be optimistic because the two people that Vega's chasing in Mbappe and this kid are special, special talent, special talent. Um, and I, and I really hope he gets him. It does worry me a little bit in the sense that if he does get him, what does this mean for Alexis's future? Um, the ideal solution would be for Ozil to fuck off and for 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 Lamar to be the guy who um who plays with Alexis just behind the Lacazette or an Mbappe. That would be the uh, ideal solution. But we'll see. Uh, I'm I don't know. I'm I'm encouraged, but I'm a little bit yeah. But why weren't we more decisive about this? It's, it always almost feels like we're we're kind of umming and ahhing and then thinking, all right, let's have a cheeky bit at this and see where we stand. I would reject it too. It's 30 million for one of their best players. Come to them with a real bid. And let's see if they're still talking that same bars of, oh, we're not going to sell him at any price. Come with a real bid. Because I put this out there on Twitter. Don't be surprised if you suddenly see Monaco go for a Mares. Because I don't think we need Mares. I do think we need that Lamar kid though. So I'd be all but happy to see us go for Lamar, uh, for Monaco to go for Mares, and everybody's problems sorted. But we'll see. We'll see. I'm not going to put it out there like I know everything. I haven't even watched the video as I record this, but I know my boy Lee is taking a certain Twitter handle apart, and so and he deserves it. He certainly does deserve it because this guy every single summer starts creating stories from nowhere and people listen. People that don't know him listen. So I hope he gets taken apart for that. But anyway, that's not my fight. Back to this. Let's hope and pray that Arsenal signs somebody. And if it's somebody of the calibre of an Mbappe, um, of an Mbappe or a Thomas Lamar, I will be very happy indeed. 
You guys let me know what you think about this kid. Do you think he's another one that's all hype? Sure, if you Surely if you do, you never saw that England match. 14 goals, 14 assists. This guy is not all hype. There is something. 21 years old as well. I think this kid could be special. Anyway, leave your comments below. Gosh, I look dog rough in this. <laughs> I'm looking at my stubble. Yes, I am 32, but I've had white stubble grow since I was 19. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know. Anyway, I'm out of it. I'm now I'm going to get bashed for this. Take care. Peace.